now I'm going to use the table of values that I just made to make a plot of this data. And numbers makes it pretty easy to do that. I just have to select this table and figure out what kind of plot I want to make. I'll make a scatter plot. Um, and now it's plotted the x values in this column versus the y values in this column. So let's let's look at our chart here. Um, now first of all, we want this to be a log log plot. Magnitude's already a log scale, so that's fine. We can leave that alone. We want to change it so that the y-axis is a log scale. And we can do that right here. Um, and then we want to clean up some things about this plot, right? Because chart 4, for example, is really not a very good title. Let's call it something else that's more meaningful. Um, we don't need a legend because we're only plotting one piece of data, so let's get rid of that. Um, and then let's use the chart inspector over here to um, to figure out how we're going to label our axes, because you have to label your axes, otherwise people don't know what you're plotting. And what what's on the y-axis? The y-axis is showing the number of earthquakes greater than or equal to some magnitude. Um, and then the x-axis is um, the magnitude. We'll just call it m. And now we can clean this up a little bit. There. Also, I don't really like the data symbol. Uh, it's just my own personal preference to use something besides a plus mark. Uh, and let's connect the points. There we go. That's it. You've made your plot. Looking good.